all the trees begin to moan And the monsters grunt and groan Rotting faces full of slime Don't you know it's terror time? Alright everyone, welcome back to Just Be Remake Versus. I'm your host here is Max, drunk as fuck, and I'm joined by Jacob taking one in the temple. Oh, I'm CJ. And, and the British runner. Alright, I'm gonna leave this off. Oh my god, that Chuck Miser is just so delicious. Fuck, I've I... got good news. I have a chance to catch up thanks to Jaegermeister. Thank you, Jaegermeister, for no. sponsoring this video. No, I think it's the <laughs> no. upside. You're, actu you're actually right. I thought about saying that joke instead, that you are now the drunken master and I'm screwed. <laughs> hey, I did a spear one drunk. Oh, uh, that's... that's... something I ought to try sometime. Yeah, let's just say that I got slow motion. I will say that I am getting drunk on the marker right now, running away from the hunter. I got a blow these pus sacks, right? That's right, yes. You gotta get all pussy. That's right, I said pussy. Enjoy that demonetization. <laughs> I bet it won't catch it, though. Eh, don't worry, I'm just gonna put a cat sound effect. <laughs> exactly, just put pictures of cats. Uh, where are the pustules? Oh my god, the hunter. That is... Oh. Are you okay? Alright. That was interesting. Cargo loader activated. Oh, my friends. I am stuck in the room with the hunter because I simply don't... I simply don't recall where the pustules are. Now I'm actually playing Dead Space. It's kind of funny. I've gone from racing, speedrunning, I've gone all the way through to just, like, playing the game now. <laughs> Thank you, Marker. Thank you for fucking up the hunter for me. Wait, I shouldn't be saying thank you, Marker. No, you shouldn't. By mounting insanity. It is continuing. Oh, I seriously don't know where to shoot it. Drunk Helios, help! Where do I shoot the pustule? I have no idea. The marker. Oh, hell! I gotta free the elevator, but I don't remember how. Oh. Ooh, ay, ay, ay. As we near the end of the game, I say, as British continues to catch up with me, I just want to say, I can't wait to do more weird, stupid runs of the Dead Space series. I cannot wait. This game's fantastic. Oh. Right, that was close. At me. What's that? I'm still looking. I'm still looking around this room. I'm still looking around this room. I can't oh, find it. Oh, dang. Hmm. Skill issue. It is actually a skill issue. It really is. Like, I'm trying to follow the tendrils now, and I can't find the one that's glowing enough. Maybe I should just run for the mess hall. Maybe you should do that. Maybe. I probably should, honestly. Oh my God. Poor. My god, I did it again! Oh my god, I realized why I just did that. I was following the original flow. Again. Oh. Because I just entered the room where Mercer is. And I was... Oh my god, I forgot that you need to burst the pustules one at a time and then come back. Oh, man. I'm so used to collecting key cards. The necromorphs used to... The necromorphs used to have such, like... Clearance here, and now they no longer do. No, nope. they got they got demoted, all of them. I gotta say, I love this shout out to Dead Space 3, the turn it off in the crew quarters. Hell yeah, 
Like, mm. thanks. Mm. Like, because that, Dead Space 3 is the black sheep. Ow. So to, to even reference it so heavily. Now go Murphs. Fuck off. Yup. All the dividers in there are so frustrating. Uh, I don't have help backs. And no worries. Patient Isaac Clark. Why does he have to sound so sinister? What did I like? I'm just trying to survive. Here. Maybe I'm going insane. Maybe Mercer's not real. Maybe. Oh, that's right. In the dark here, there are. That's right. There are uh, guardians here. Oh hell! Out of the way, asshole. That should do it. Yep. Oh, thank God, I got the right one. I got the correct one. Only one. It's like one guy lies and one guy tells the truth. <laughs> like one guardian will kill you and the other will let you live. And I, I killed the right one. Hey, Hunter. You know what? You are as excited as a guy named Hunter would be. I lived in the South. I know what okay, guys I'm named now, Hunter are like. I'm now getting out of the fella. Hell yes! Oh, I need the battery. That's right. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. That was a good. What is this battery? That oh, wasn't really nice. Oh boy, this battery. Oh, all these dividers in here and stuff. Hello, fellas. Goodbye, fellas. All right. Oh, hello again, fellas. Stasis, fellas, enjoy. This is why I upgraded it. Oh, just so you know, I put a couple points into stasis. Oh, it was actually England. a good idea. It, it's saving my bacon here at the end of the run. Making bacon. Oh, I wish. That's you with the flamethrower. Me, I'm just running for my goddamn life. Don't let any girls get your cheeks. So, I actually had them directly on the cheek. They were spreading them, my friend, as I boarded the elevator. <laughs> Thank goodness for Twitchers. Like, shooting that Twitchers stasis unit saved my ass. Oh, and gr oh, he came back! He this is the same fella. Hey, buddy. Thanks for the save earlier. Now die, please. Twitchers are kill on sight. Yeah, they're recovering quite fast. Oh. All right, that should do the jump. Hmm. You know how very, I can tell the fatigue time. is setting in? I've just escaped the crew quarters kitchen. Hmm. I'm being followed by every, ev I'm being followed by every leaper. Slowly walking on the goop. Cool. How about yourself? I'm in an um, hmm. Right now, I'm uh, on the area where you need to guide the marker to the shuttle. Oh, wow, you've completed the segment. Again, it is segments that segment us. <laughs> you, yeah, you are. Uh, we're, we're separated by set pieces. Indeed. Not just you and I, but you, I, and British. We all have, like, major moments to complete. Oh, shit. Yeah, right now I'm just loading everything. Including the diamond semiconductor. Right, I've completely upgraded my plasma cutter now. Hmm. Well done, well done. I think I mean, I'm gonna put my... I think I'm gonna I've put... Got all the, I've got all the uh, mods on it. I think I'm gonna put my nodes back in the plasma cutter. The game's being mean to me. I have like 150 plasma and no pulse rifle. None. Pulse rifle, I think, is going in the store. I don't want any more. Mm. I'm gonna one gun it from here on, and I'm gonna gun it for Helios. It's <laughs> all I can do. <laughs> uh, I gotta use the dead space knowledge that I have as the old head. 
It is a role I'm happy to take. Oh my god, I can finally sell this oxygen kit after like eight chapters. You guys? Yes? It's a momentous occasion. I'm changing into the level three suit. Wait, now? Yes. Wait, you because, do know. you know, you do know it's, it already, it's already too late, and in the final chapters, you go a long time between stores. So, I figure, whatever. This is the main store in the crew quarters and the marker pedestal. That's like the last time. And you're telling me that you're having the level two suit all this time? Oh, that's what you were so amazed about. Yes, in fact, I've been playing the whole damn game with the level 2 suit. I have had to do some juggling, like a clown in the circus. And, uh, it's been fun! <laughs> Alright, that's impressive. <laughs> Thank you. I've suffered several deaths, but it's been fun to try and keep up. That, again, that first mistake I made of not stomping the enemies. It, uh, of not looting, like... It's amazing, my friend. This game is well balanced as all hell. Ow, you little shit. Where's that? Where's that lurker? Oh, there you are, you little sweat. Well, now, about those you're, deaths. You say, you say that you're upgrading to the level 3 suit. Well, I'm upgrading to the level 4. No, I'm already on level 5. I like that in the I end, we money. decided to change suits. That's that's something that's not necessary, but I'm glad that we, you know, just made like a gentleman's agreement that you can wear whatever the hell you want. It's a race, not a speed run. This is what I like about this is like, this is, this is, uh, this is something that friends would do on the couch on a weekend. I encourage the audience to join their, their personal discord and do this with their friends, because this shit's a blast. In the light, that's oh, you can't. I'm not upgrading anymore. Yep. Not not specifically with Dead Space. <laughs> yes, I'm, now I'm, I'm now changing into my final suit. Well, if it's FIFA, <laughs> no, I, I hate FIFA. You have to play Dead Space. Hey, I tried that with my friends. They don't want to play it. Well, although one did consider playing the remake. There we go. I'm now in my last suit. This is suit why I, for the entire This run. is why I live stream. The why I live stream, my friend, is because I have friends who do not enjoy horror games, and I want to show them the magic, so I play horror games for the world. Because there are those out there who do not like them, and I don't blame them. Uh, here, Silent Hill, Sirens Curse, Blood Curse, what else? Uh, don't be... go in the room where Isaac has the hallucination. Oh boy. I, I almost went in there, but I realized that I can't because I didn't do the side quest. Thank goodness the game won't let me. Now, I'm playing as uh, Lone Survivor Isaac. And those, How so? Uh, those hands are twitching. They're jiggling. Speaking of... Yeah, speaking of twitchy. Yeah, I, uh, I'm having a problem with twitching right now. Uh, Spike! Thank you, Twitcher! Sayonara, sucker. <laughs> Fuck is that? Where in the... Alright, I have a lot of uh, contact with ammo, but uh, I need to go with the damage. Also, I think I only have one contact with ammo, great. I gotta find that battery, that's right. Oh, that's right, I forgot you gotta find the battery to leave. Hmm. Oh, this well, woman, just, hello lady, how are you doing? Nice. It's getting there. My friend, uh, en enjoy watching the death of Jacob Temple. I hope it's satisfying. Mm -hmm. It's not. As someone, it's good. As some, you know what, as someone with Jacob also in their name, I am, I feel sympathy for the poor man for some reason. It's like when you, like when someone on a, a drama you watch shares your name, you're like, I'm pulling for them. Or someone on a reality show. You know, Nicholas Burkle one? <laughs> I got gotcha. you. This doors. Doors, not lights. Who needs lights? We don't need light to see. Twitcher in the bathroom. I will leave him enough. because he is, that Twitcher is having a, he's having a moment. 
personal time, you know what I mean? He's military. Um, by and the way, military... speak, speaking of Jacob, I'm now much in the death scene. The poor man. He never stood a chance because Mercer's got like the ultimate stasis module. I like that they let you get his stasis module after seeing it used on you. Mm, it's a prototype, it doesn't do damage. The one that he uses. It just That's has more true. duration. He... Yes, that is true. And yeah. what's interesting is uh, he has he the original dead kinda... space. Be he has the original fully upgraded dead space stasis. Y yes, that's what I was gonna say. Is it? It seems like they intentionally gave him old tech, where like he's using old dead space stuff, a rivet gun, and just a normal stasis unit and a normal unupgraded rig. But he's a badass evil doctor, and it's like and that's the one watching. part. That, that's the one part of his characterization I think is much stronger. We've been talking about Mercer throughout this. Oh, I just blasted that administrator photo. Give me that semiconductor. I destroyed that man and his wonderful turban. I love that guy's turban. I'm glad they brought that portrait back in the remake. You know the guy? The guy in the crew quarters? Mm, the guy in crew quarters. <laughs> Which one? The executive quarters. He, there, there are portraits of all the administrators, and there's one guy with a dope turban. Oh, the Turkish one. Yeah, that fella's so cool. Oh, that's right. This is the room with all the pregnants. I bet it was that guy. Oh, no. Yeah, no pregnancy in that area. I mean, it's... It's... It's my knowledge of the original again! They replaced it with an infector! Oh, of course! Because this in the original is when lurkers start coming out of pregnancy. Oh! Uh, and no, it's swarmers. Is it still swarmers? My god, my game knowledge. I ought, to start, I ought to start playing this game that I say I love so much that is one of my favorites. Dude, you're having a like lot of Asia right now. I, I think the marker's Lurisha. dementia. Everybody the marker's Lurisha. dementia is affecting me. <laughs> to be fair, we've been doing this for the entire day now, and this is a wonderful, wonderful thing that I wouldn't recommend anyone else try. Maybe do it on normal difficulty if you do it. But it's fun as all hell. Uh, the problem is it's stressful. I'm going to die when I'm 30 because we did this today, but it will be worth it. That last one year of life. <laughs> it's up. I've made... Yes. I've made it to the part. I've made it to the part where you get your comeuppance on the hunter. Hmm. You just need to slap it. Ah, uh, oh, not yet. I was wrong. I have one tendril to go. Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, uh, I thought I was so close, but no, there's one more door. I just looked at the tendrils and I was, I didn't see anymore. And then I turned the corner and nope, it's kind. Yeah. That game what flow. Is. Game flow. All right. I am going to really enjoy the new game plus run, my friends, because... This is a learning experience for all of us. We're all going to have more game sense after this run. Oh game god, what the hell? Silly word, two but... of them? Oh, I didn't know there was two of them. What you have, two British? The, uh, the Guardians. Ah, yes. Oh, those bastards. I, I see almost second. got got by them. I know the exact ones you mean. <laughs> yeah. Where are, you, where are you gonna spoil my game? Where, where are, are you are basically closed right now then? Oh no, you're already like at the last one. Oh, yeah, all the way he's, back he's got a he's got a little ways to go, and this is actually an interesting game flow thing. I, I liked in the original that you could get the key cards for the crew deck in any order. But the story events and stuff, like Mercer getting eaten, talking to Kine, that all still happened. They made sure that you could do everything in any order in this chapter, including play basketball. A long ass chapter. You should have played basketball, Helios. I think you actually had time to play basketball for the rewards and still beat me. 
And I'm just gonna play basketball on the colony. What, there. with like the heads? I, I, you know, oh, I should have gone in that room and put it on camera. I love the room that someone has set up bowling with heads and legs. Uh, people find their time on the Ishimura and they spend it well. Hey, but it's confirmed. Why is it you bowling? Does the bowling well? Huh. It's true, you get a real strike. Achievement. He's a Z bowler. It's true. <laughs> He's like a, he could like shoot a 10 pointer from hey. the free throw line. The man self confirmed it. Oh, Might bye, Kai. Right. I'm so glad that Gunnar Wright is attached to Isaac Clark, the character. Talking about, talking about, you know, voice acting and voice actors. I really like voice actors that play a certain character. Uh, Doug Cockle, the voice of Agent mm. Forty Seven, is, you know. A big ass fan of Hitman, Agent Forty Seven, the universe. Like, mm. uh, excuse me, excuse me. Doug Cockle is the name of the guy who voices Geralt. Uh, oh, what's the name of the? Either way, Cockle. like, <laughs> also, like the point. The point is, right? No, I'm getting my names mixed up. They are dedicated to their roles, and that makes the game better. It makes their roles better. Yeah, I was, I don't know, for Gunner Wright, maybe Isaac Clark was like one of his bigger roles. Like, I know he played it in G.I. Joe, but like yes, other indeed. movies. So I, I would uh, equate him, um, I, would, I would equate his career trajectory with uh, James McCaffrey, the voice actor for Max Payne, who was, you know, physically motion captured as Max Payne in the third game, but has always voiced him since the first, and he doesn't do any other voice acting. And so that performance as Max has landed him other roles on TV. He was on Jessica Jones, uh, and he, he has been on TV since then. Hmm. It's just interesting. Yeah, when you have like a big uh, uh, an audience, like even though the voice actor for Girl Rivia, the English version, just right Indeed. from the first one. Nailed it, yeah, really. Like you, you get a voice actor every now and then that just totally nails mm -hmm. their roles, and and even the ones that you see in uh, all kinds of media, uh, your Troy Bakers and Nolan Norths, they have iconic characters. Yeah, I would say uh, no one else could have done Captain Walker from Spec Ops: The Line better than someone experienced like Nolan North. So, the it's the voice acting industry is great. I'm glad mm -hmm. that acting is having like unionizing happen and all kinds of good things for the actors themselves because they deserve that shit. Yeah. When it comes I'm to pro, video game I'm pro actors union. and uh, voice actors, some, like, there are, like, some of them that can do both, like, voice acting and doing a real, uh, life. Yes, like with, indeed. Uh, like the, the Witcher, there are... yeah, the voice mm, actor doesn't have the appearance of Geralt, but uh, Harry Cavill? Oh. I just exactly. I'm still there, like, there are, It blows you away how they were able to make a different guy also be the same character through uh, 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 his own take on the performance. It's it's brilliant. It's really cool. It's synthesis in a way. Like they, mm. hey, it's almost like they actually cared. And when you care, it ends up a better product. <laughs> yeah, Until still, the second season. Yeah, I'm still bad for that too. They just did. Henry literally dirty. They did. They did him dirty. And yes, indeed, that uh, that that has happened throughout the years to actors, voice actors in general, where it's like they are considered expendable by big wig executives, and it's a shame because they have real ass talent. I'm glad we're getting a new generation of those with uh, games like the Resident Evil remakes. They're hiring. Um, people who are new to the industry, hmm. uh, people who are, uh, like for example, uh, the voice actor for Leon in the Resident Evil 2 remake, uh, oh. the voice actor for Ethan Winters. Hmm. There are lots of people who are barely voice actors yet, but have big careers ahead of them because, like, they they were in games that gave a shit. The person. All right, that, uh, Hunter time. 
person that uh, that uh, Leon looks like is Romanian. Hey, dope Romanian rep, baby. That's neat. Yeah, that's always cool. Yeah, the model that uh, they that Leon has the likeness is Romanian. Like literally, when I found that's... or like bombers, like holy, hold, hold on a second, he's Romanian. That's dope, man. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay, Hunter, get in place, and I will. I will be right back, my friend. You stay here. Hmm. I've just cast fire in the engines. We're gonna go down to the planet together. I have ditched Nicole and found someone new because the Hunter is unbelievably strong. Hmm. I am so impressed with Mercer managing to create actual regenerating matter. That is how in. Well, the he took it from the corruption. Hmm. Oh, he stole it, indeed. He stole their uh, biology. Oh, that's right, the drag tentacle. Mm, I well, was just so happy. Some, some uh, research, and thanks to some of the Nicole's uh, uh, analysis, I was I literally about to say that. Dude, you and I are in sync. I was about to say, I am so happy that they have given Nicole a role in this because she's a doctor. She would be, she talks in the first game about assessing the wounds and stuff. And so it makes natural sense. Hmm. One of the more logical changes in the story and why earlier when you mentioned Mercer, you know, collaborating with Nicole, but secretly not, mm, not like I gave Mercer more credit. Collaborating, just taking the... Right, you know, I know what you mean. Like, the yeah. message notes, which yeah. got caught by Mercer in his uh, room, I think? But giving those notes to Nicole instead of some random crew member is what I like about the remake a lot. That, again, I think I said this in the early part, it doesn't have very many characters, and so it gave them all really cool stuff to do. Importance. Way to go, Motive. Yeah, we could say that those Except, series... we except say hey, that Motive, too. why are you trapping me in here? We can say that those research notes kind of saved Nicole's ass when she got caught by Mercer. Indeed, they did. I I enjoyed following that storyline. Yeah, because because following... he was like already, he was already like aiming at her with the this module. Indeed, and it is depth to Mercer's character that I think that he probably didn't have in the first game. That's a point that I'll give the remake for Mercer's character, hmm. is that original Mercer probably would have fired on whoever it was and just taken the notes hmm. and said, oh, you will be reborn later, or whatever. The but the quest. new Mercer is yeah. a little more subtly psychopathic, so I get it, man. Do you yeah. think that he he do Nicole's body? The thing is, he mentions Nicole is busy like he, he he mentions like I imagine that Nicole is somewhere on the ship nothing to do with Mercer but the connection to the marker means that maybe Mercer knows something mm. about Dr. Brennan it I makes mean, me wonder if he knows the truth about her you I know mean, about he's the read remains. the chapter titles the he's remains read, of her, yeah. Nicole I was gonna say he's read the chapter titles Nah. Would have been bad. You know. You know what I'm so glad they did instead. I'm glad that they identified Harris, Ugh. such that it wasn't left ambiguous who the hunter was. Oh, uh, there were like hints that, in the original. Yes, that, that was one thing they couldn't change because it would have been bad. Oh hell! I, I went to the flight deck, but I went wrong spot oh i'm following the line oh shit that's right i am going the right way but the line hasn't updated yet because kendra was still talking of course shit i'm in big yeah, cool. <laughs> yeah it totally doesn't work yeah i'm heading to the i'm heading to the cargo bay and uh i went to the flight lounge instead that is after this we gotta get the thing to the gotta get the thing to the bay first I would love, I would love to see the city by the cargo bay. Oh, it sounds lovely this time of year. You're a bit annoying. 
Oh boy. I gotta say the neighbors, the neighbors here in the cargo city by the bay are, uh, they leave a lot to be desired. People talk shit about homeowners associations, but maybe they need one here. It is a good thing that throwing something at a pregnant doesn't pop it still, because yeah, you were right. Isaac aims for center mass. Dude, Isaac, it's dangerous. All right, he's set. <sighs> Where you at? Position um, check? Uh, I'm on the second part of the... of delivering the marker. Wow, okay. I am in the first part. I'm in the first segment. British? Wait, you're already in chapter 12. Yes, I indeed. I made it. I, I made it and I don't wait, have the master wait, override, wait, so wait, don't go wait, for the card. Wait, 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 where are you? Marker, cargo bay. Oh, so you're oh, in the, chapter, uh, 11. Cha chapter 11, not chapter 12. <laughs> oh, excuse me, yes. Oh, yes. I did not catch up that much. <laughs> no. Oh. Uh, I'm, I'm like surprised what the hell. I wanna pick up Peng. I wanna. I'm gonna. I have to. I'll grab her before I leave. You sell it and I'll murder you. I will engage in some Peng. I will engage in some Peng with my friends. You sell the Peng and I'll murder you personally. My friend, I didn't plan on it. I will take this thing to the end of the game every time I play it. That I, I, I love it. <laughs> like, I mean, it's it's like almost the unofficial mascot. It's a necroposting signature. Indeed. You do not simply sell the pink and bring it with you till the end. I feel like... I, I... Oh man, I feel like I know the direct inspiration for Pen Because I've watched a lot of cyberpunk since playing Cyberpunk 2077 and just it it seems like this example of this future brand that you're never supposed to know exactly what it is but the name is enough to make you question where you're wondering what the fuck is Peng and why do they offer it everywhere well it'll be like uh, something really yeah. like label magazine indeed or something else but, but mostly like well, they you know, sexual that, that's the connotation, right? And what I like about a lot of cyberpunk is that they subvert that by having it not be that if you investigate it. Uh, where it's like, it's just got a dirty name, but inside it's like, I don't know, mm -mm -mm. a relaxation parlor or some shit. Oh, guess what I just found out? There's another real dick move checkpoint. If you uh, fail yeah. on moving, if you fail on moving the marker in the cargo hold for the first time, it will reset the whole set piece, including the globs. Yeah. You gotta pop the globs again. As every time. That's something I've. That's something I've just learned. Mentioning all the time that I'm losing, it's really kind of you, honestly. You should keep. You should keep on doing it. You know, every time I lose time, just call it out, homie. Oh, this poor pregnant. I'm sorry. Uh. <laughs> All right. Why, if I were a youngin like the rest of you, I know that I could hang with the strategeries. Oh, I know that I could employ the tactics. This game doesn't make you feel like that. There are some games that make you feel completely useless if you're not really good at them. On purpose, because, you know, you're meant to be a super soldier. Metal Gear, for example, will shit all over you if you get an alert and don't hide immediately. And it's fair, because you're supposed to be a super spy. And this game is a little punishing, I feel. A little bit. I mean, I'm just an engineer. Alright, I'm just gonna use some contact in there. Alright. Yeah, how are, how are we doing on ammo supplies, fellas? So far so good in my... on my end. Yeah, I, I swapped back from pulse rifle to plasma cutter, and 
Basically, now I'm using the pulse rifle to clean up pustules and other stuff with one tap. And it's working out. It's working out. Enhanced enemies get the contact beam. Pregnants also get the contact beam. Goodbye, pregnant. Access bridge is obstructing transfer, my ass. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. I mean... Only in one direction. Why not move it in the other direction, Isaac? Just ignore the gunk. Just that kinesis hurts. it past the gunk. You did it in the other game. Uh, uh, here we go. That's right, there's gunk blocking the tracks again. And there's enemies behind me. And All in right. front of me, too. No health. I'm kind of fucked. Yeah, that's okay. So am I. Ooh, this cargo base segment is... It's tough. It's really tough. And and the Necromorphs have very little stagger. Enhanced ones are... Essentially wearing more armor than Isaac. Yeah. Eat a pustule. Aw, oh, you shitting me. Oh, no hell. Why I went that way? Fuck it. Ah, did you try to take a faster route and it didn't pan out for you? Yeah. I died. But the one because the exploder got lucky. I feel your pain on the exploder getting lucky. I feel. Boy, do I feel it. Call, recall a part, few parts earlier. Oh. Time to make my enemies eat hot plasma. Which I'd love to do in real life. I'd love to I'd love to make my enemies eat my hot plasma in real life. Sadly not possible all the time. I love the May on the ship when it says retrieval may be delayed as if at this point in like chapter 11 you won't expect a delay or it's like nah i'm sure it'll be fine get it done get it done ship fucking die <laughs> oh really i had to reload fuck it you're done you son of a bitch <laughs> oh you oh come on Who's who's done? Is it like dinner? Are they are they done like dinner? No, the hunter. Very nice. Yeah, I am a bastard, and I'm Mercer. I mean, by the by the definition, right? But I don't think that matters. I think that's fine. I I think this is a case where you know religious zealotry is okay. Bye, Mr. Oh, we're just getting dragged through the bow. Oh. Yep, and I am stuck in the cargo hold. This game is hard. Oh, and I am exhausted. I'm loving it. Come on, Rich. Pull a marker. Nice. Fuck you. You're not getting me. Oh, and you are oh, headed down to the so, planet, so are you? That was so close. Who, cool, me? Yeah. I am. Hard. I am on the planet. Oh, Helios is headed down to Asia 7. Congratulations. Aegis. You are now Aegis. leaving. You are now leaving the Ishimura. No. How's it I, feel? I'm already on the Aegis 7. I just delivered the marker well, on the Pedestro Chamber. How Seems does it feel? Look, I just want to finish the high might. <laughs> uh, I can't wait for the taunts. The taunts on New Game Plus are going to be excellent. We're going for all those side missions and all that, so he's going to have the extra dialogue. Sure. Eat my dick, Marker!
All right. I mean, that's kind of what I feel like saying at this point, though, honestly. <laughs> maybe that's what everyone who plays Dead Space feels at some point, is like, like maybe you're intended to dislike the marker as an object. Yes, it is. Lovely. Okay. Oi. Shipment 782 really needs to hurry the hell up. Hey, this Shipment is 79 experience. Hell yeah, fuck the four for free. With whom? Who did you have that experience with in this game? What? Who wants? Is, is that an experience you want to have in this game? I feel like it's undesirable. Oh no, I meant uh, the, the Nicole's video. Like, there's more for, for free ratio. And, uh, then I see. The, and then you can see the 16 for 9. Ratio on the screens uh, on the um, on the their control. I just kind of assumed that things had gone tick tock for you, and I was like, my sympathies, homie. <laughs> oh, no. like oh, you're yeah. gonna finish the game in portrait mode now. Isaac Clark's you can actually see out of the slits in Isaac Clark's helmet. That it's that realistic. And to cool. away we go hello marker how you doing buddy uh get out of my way please <laughs> okay i i like that the marker is your buddy in this run i i don't know i don't know why they made the chain i i guess it fits with the original lore that you are protected by the marker if it considers you worthy but not transformed it's preserving Isaac, basically, by harming the necromorphs, weakening them so they can't hurt it. It's just... Um, no, that's so, not how it goes at all. Hmm. What? But in the in the anime, no. the w no. one lady takes cover no. near the marker and the necromorphs no. can't come no. near it. No, 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 no. They've changed it. Have they? Yeah, to make it better. Oh, boy. What's the, what's yeah, no, the lore so now? That's confusing. Phil said. That's confusing. The fact is, yeah, if you actually read the uh, Nicole log that you get at the end of the game, um, she actually has a conversation with an apparition that comes from the marker, which was Octavia Clark, Isaac's mother. True. So, basically, ah. what, so basically what happens is that um, Octavia will say if one cannot bring the mark, if the, one cannot bring the makers to the marker, then they will have to bring marker back to the planet and like bring back what was taken i had forgotten that i i had forgotten entirely about nicole's new ability to communicate with the marker in a strange kind of medical science way it is uh it is interesting that the new game plus logs reflect that because they didn't have to make that change. They could have kept them the same as the OG, and lots of folks wouldn't have even seen them. But it's really cool that they added new ones. They added new dialogue to them. Mm. After all, it's in the of, story, the they set that out. up. There are a lot of channels out there that don't understand what the actual story of Dead Space is because they can't be bothered well, to read the logs. Well, it's interesting. It's interesting how the wiki essentially covers everything. Mm. And but sometimes the wiki can be wrong. Well, I mean, there are two versions of the game now, and it's the most fascinating thing. Marker ecology has changed so much over the years. It is, like, it's something almost that the developers have done almost on purpose, but on accident, where nobody really understands how the marker works because... Well, it's an alien artifact made by aliens the marker, to the take over. The marker essentially is like an, a mobile network tower. 
Yeah, yeah, basically. Yeah, ex yeah, Break kinda. Take the signal from the moon and then, what do you call it? Um, kind of, what do you call it? Basically, the marker's ability is to spread the signal as much as possible. <laughs> well, what I like is that you can ask anyone the in the Dead Space world the what it does and get a dozen different answers. What's up, Helios? Yo. How you doing? Where you at? Ah, uh, waiting before the final boss. Oh, wow, my friend. He's almost there. He's almost there. I'm fighting my way through the flight lounge. I'm almost out of this hell hole. All right. And it is hell. Do you feel prepared for and the I'm hive dead. mind of the toughest boss fight in games? Fucking great yes. game here, Motiv. You, you really outdid yourself with the bullshit here. Not even visceral games could live up to your fucking hype, mate. And they, what? they, they fucking trailed in bullshit. I cannot wait to see the horrible fate that befell you, my friend. I, you have my sympathies. Oh shit, I got hit by two tentacles and got devoured by one fucking pregnant. Ridiculous. Again, that happened to me earlier in this very run, where Man, the like game the just decided... Of damage you take in hard mode. I got... Oh, 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 it's, it's wonderful. Back. Yes. I mean it. Great game. Great fucking game. <sighs> hey, Kine, how you doing? Are you Can wearing your bulletproof made... vest? Couldn't they have just left this area alone and just let let it be like the original? It is funny how you start you start to think that kind of like over over time you start to think like, oh man, this is frustrating. Shouldn't they have, uh, excuse me kept it the same? <laughs> In the middle of that sentence. Uh, no, it's the perfect sentence because it's the perfect Grognard thing. Area. Just this one area. I know, I know, but there are so many that are like, why didn't they keep everything the same? Why did they change it at all? It was perfect. It's, a remake. And it's yeah. like, yeah. <laughs> if it was a remaster, sure. But this ain't no remaster. Game. Yeah, and also to Dude. make the speedrunners not going for the same. That too. That that's actually something uh, interesting about The Last of Us. They cooperated with speedrunners to make their new game plus speedrun mode. Uh, in that they brought actual Last of Us speedrunners to their studio and showed them the preview build and said, "Does this have everything you'd need to speedrun?" Hmm. And they said no, and they made the changes. And it's really interesting. It's just. Uh, I'm glad developers are paying attention to different hobbies like that, because uh, you don't gotta. It's optional for them. But it's not how they make their money, is the thing. Getting a sense of community doesn't make you your money, but it's nice that we've gone beyond what EA did to Dead Space 3, where they just treated the community like cash cows. Nah, Motive mm. knew. Motive knew they had a lot to live up to, so they showed previews. Yeah, built but eight. the thing is, yeah, a lot of people don't understand is EA's job is to find ways of making more money out, you know, pumping more money out of their stuff. Oh, you're correct, but the ways that but they do it are... They have a responsibility to their investors and all that stuff as well. True. Indeed. You know, it's not It's not just, oh, we're greedy, we want more money. No, we have, they have responsibility to other people that invested in their business and still continue to invest in their oh, business to bring out oh. games and all that stuff. Indeed. They are in a, a world and a state of business where they basically have to be some form of greedy in order to maintain a profit, where they can't treat customers necessarily like people and individuals because that would take forever. Look at stuff like Facebook no, it's moderation. Not like that. It's just like, what do you call it? I mean, EA did not bring us microtransactions first. You know? No. I mean, not even mobile games did microtransactions first. Well, that's the thing, is they've been around since video I games mean, have like been around, arcade, really. Arcade machines were the first one to actually make, what do you call it, um, microtransactions. Which included. Yeah, arcade machines. There's one that you could put more money into it to unlock cosmetic um, stuff and all that. 
there is stuff that there is stuff that gamifying leads yeah. to I feel like you know it leads to unethical business it leads to the type of investors that you don't want to have to appease and I think that is the trap that EA fell into where they they fell into the trap of saying like oh shit we now need to sell five million copies of a series that hasn't ever broken that before. So, what do we do? We pander to everything. And they did. And so the game sucked. <laughs> and that's just a game. A game, Fury. Bro, I really did evoke that kind of, like, manner of speech. I'm so sorry. But I'm also not. Out of Plasma Cutter. Out of plasma cutter right at the end of moving the marker. Oh boy. It's cool. All I need to do is put the gravity back and uh, I think the guardian is gone. What? I put reposition the marker. What? I did. Nice. What do you mean? What do I uh oh. What am I doing wrong? Uh Well, it's been a pleasure high mine, but I have a shuttle to take. My friend, congratulations. Well done. That is Dead Space Mastery at its finest. You proved that scavenging is more important than speed. Fuck this game, man. You just keep spawning enemies everywhere. <laughs> I love the two statements there back to back. That's the, fantastic. The duality of men. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Hey, hey, Helios, what the fuck do I do to get the marker on the shuttle? I don't remember. Uh, do you I have need to hit to... the box? Uh, did you power up the the, the line racks? Of course, I totally didn't hit. I moved it under the shuttle, and I don't recall what to do next. Uh, did you kill all the en oh? Did you kill all? The oh, you gotta, yeah, that's right. You gotta kill all the enemies and then to have... reposition the marker. Uh no. Uh, damn you, game. Uh. No, you need to kill all the enemies so you can uh, turn back to gravity. Yes, that's what I meant, is it's the final step of that process. Mm -hmm. I think I actually was just told that by <laughs> Kendra, but mm -hmm. I was... I was killing them, so I wasn't listening. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll it, go let Dr. Kine in. Yeah. Anyways, I will uh, suggest you guys to go to a safe station and save your progress. I can't. Well... Uh, when you have the opportunity. Yeah, oh, I my friend. I can't right now. Don't worry. I've got a little left to play, too, because I have to avenge Dr. Kine's death. He got shot in the dick on my screen. He went right through his tailbone and right into his groin. Kendra, how dare you? <laughs> he didn't deserve that. But you're right. Uh, once I get down die. to the planet, I'll hit the first save station. Yeah, this gun's fucking shit. Does nothing, absolutely nothing. Which one? Elios, have you have terrible. you reached the mm. credits, the end of the game, my friend? <sighs> and those guys shoot heat-seeking fucking bone shards for some reason. Yeah, I Nico just gave me a little kiss. I told you and, him and I gotta say, you deserve it. After all of that effort, it's like Kendra says, "You're a hell of a, you're a hell of an engineer." Fucking <laughs> out. Uh, and and I gotta say, homie, congratulations, because I was convinced that the speedrun strategy of being fast and not scavenging would pay off. I was incorrect, Mea culpa. Well, I'm just gonna put, uh, I call it, uh, the screen on your. Well, the footage on your both uh, sides until you reach a uh, safe station. So we can end. Uh, good, my friend. Yeah, so we can end the episode. Uh, I end this episode, yeah. I'm literally on standby. Um, as am I. Sure. I'm watching Kendra fly away at this moment. There's a safe station next to Nicole, isn't there? Um, Up upstairs. I think so. All right. I'll hit the next one I see, my friend, <laughs> because this run has been fascinatingly long, where like, I didn't remember Dead Space being this long of a game. There isn't a save station in the tram waiting area. Uh, no, there's uh, before reaching the cargo. Yeah, cargo bay. Inside, inside of a quarantine. Quarantine? Mm -hmm. What? Oh yeah, that's true. 
The launch, the flight launch. You're referring. Yep. That's right. I'll head back to the flight lounge. Instead of talking to Nicole, I'll head right there, my friend. Good call, British. <laughs> Us is. I am going to upgrade first before I go there, cause I'm not. I'm not a fool. Oh come on! That really. This game can't just give me a fucking break. Nope. Ha what what happened this time, man? Right at the Necromorph end of it all. Necromorph is just like what do you call it, laying on the ground in the tram waiting area. He's oh, he's playing play dead. He's playing dead. Oh, I love it. I I didn't know that they could play dead in the tram area. And we've encountered so much shit in the tram. That was something that I always actually disliked about the original Dead Space is there was a place where you're always safe. Your oh, buddy, the tram. Never mind, I found a safe station. Right next As to the did bench. I in the flight lounge. Right next to the oh. bench. All right. All right. There we you, have it. Yeah, do you win? Saves your progress. Pause and, game and. Oh no, we'll call. We are calling it for now. Congratulations, yeah. Helios. That's why I said to go to a safe station, so you can save your progress. Uh, to say this Would... game is bullshit. Absolutely, it bullshit. is. It yeah. is, and I I think it's fair bullshit though, where they give you the no, tools to really bullshit them right all. back. It's not very fair oh, the... at all. Like the fucking aim system is terrible. The original aim system was better. I mean, like, come on. Uh, that's true. Ah, like, uh, the original like... aim was better. And I missed the laser sight. Like, seriously, like on the Xbox. Aiming was better on the original, even in Dead Space 2. Like, come on, like, you, uh, I'll give, I'll like, give how it points, am I though? supposed to take these enemies down swiftly and not taking any damage if I can't fucking aim at them? It is, it is difficult to <laughs> it adjust is to, but it's all hell. Like trying to get through this game as quickly as possible, but yet dying as many times as possible because you can't fucking hit the enemy because oh, they're really fast and you can't aim. It is an interesting <sighs> compromise between 1 and 2, where they used the bullets actually coming out of Isaac, but used the aim point reticle. And so it's kind of like, not a good mixture. I understand your frustration, my friend, and I think you've done well fighting it this entire time. Now, would and you like to end this with me? And, and also on top of that, yeah, oh, enemies that were supposed to die, but they didn't. Yeah, that's fun, isn't it? But British. No wonders I haven't played this game since this fucking launch. But British. Oh. Would you like to end this with me and see who emerges with the silver medal? Um, okay. But we're at the end of this episode, so we can't really do so. Let's do it next time! Thanks for watching, everybody. Helios is blasted on Jägermeister, so I'll handle it. I'm your pal C. Jacobs, and the British runner has joined me with Helios Max for Let's Race Dead Space Remake. One more, my friends. Congrats, dude, Helios. Dude, you're literally the hype man. You're literally the yes man. I should, I should invite you in more events, honestly. <laughs> oh, honestly, like I was a, Jacob's I was a rap MC. Jacob literally keeps, he just makes I don't know the situation more alive, basically. But it's kind of sad that everyone apart then, oh, that would have been the mother of all the cocktails, honestly. Friends, right. I'm you. happy to be the chain that ties us together.